So over in the two states that share a single amusement park, we have Intimidator, the roller coaster that doesn't immediately pop into your mind when mentioning a Red Track Cedar Fair 200 plus foot steel roller coaster themed to Dale Earnhardt. Anyways, Intimidator opened on March 27th of 2010 for about $23 million. This is a B&M Hyper and sits at a height of 232 feet, features over 5,300 feet of track, and reaches a top speed of 75 miles an hour. The ride starts off with a 74 degree first drop that will be awesome no matter where you are sitting. Next, you will ascend to the first of seven giant camelback hills which actually represent each of Dale Earnhardt's championships. The first one is pretty unique because it has a sudden right-hand turn as you descend. The next one is unfortunately trimmed but still offers a good floater. Then you'll traverse a wacky hammerhead turnaround which feels really quirky. Afterwards comes the next two camelbacks in succession. The first one trimmed, the second one not trimmed. This takes you into the mid-course which may or may not kill some of your momentum. Finally, you will execute a somewhat pointless helix and then a few more floaty hills which lead you into the final break run. This roller coaster is definitely a lot of fun but not super intense. Unfortunately, its nickname Intrimidator is kinda true as the trimmed camelbacks hit kinda hard and tamper with the ride experience. Nonetheless, this is still one of the best hypercoasters I've ever ridden. This roller coaster gets an 8.85 out of 10.